Hey you guys, here with an unwrapping and hands-on look of the LEGO Movie Video Game for the PlayStation Vita. Uh, this game is also available for PlayStation 3, PlayStation 4, uh, Nintendo 3DS, uh, Nintendo Wii if I'm not mistaken, and Xbox One and Xbox 360. Almost every single platform you could think of. I don't really know if it's, a, it's available for, um, if it's gonna be available for smartphones and tablets, but um, here it is. Uh, this is the 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 way this the cover looks. Um, on every console, it looks just the same. You got Emmett here. You also got Lucy over here. Uh, you got the the bad cop, good cop over here. Uh, I don't know. This is if this is yeah should be the bad cop, good cop. Uh, here you got the bad guy. Here you got Batman over here. Uh, here you got Gandalf, <laughs> the blind one. And over here, like you can see, it's a one player touch screen. Also has parental control support. I don't know why would this game have that. And requires five megabytes of memory. Uh, like you see over here, it says build awesome creations to save the world. Also says uh, play with over 90 of the, of the most surprising mix of characters. Uh, journey through fantastic worlds made of lego bricks not bad look at that uh this game was available or is available for 29.99 which is not bad for being the physical copy uh kind of cheap that's why i decided to get this one uh, honestly i did want to get the playstation 4 version because of the playstation 4 i can actually play on the playstation vita at home but let's go ahead and put this on the playstation vita Okay, so here it is. Let's go ahead and load up the game. Let's go ahead and take a snapshot there. That way I got a nice looking wallpaper there available. Okay, so here it is. Let's see what's this over here. So from here, I guess you can um, either switch the saving area. Let's go ahead there, choose new game. Saving, uh, let me see what else you could do here. You could go ahead and lock, I guess. Uh, enter a code. I guess this game has some unlockables over here. I guess this must be like the credits of the game. And over here, the sound, you could turn it on or off. And over here, you got the mic. Hmm, I wonder why would you want to turn this game uses the mic. Uh, but first, before we keep on going, let me go ahead and show you guys the trophies. This game has 35 trophies, even though it doesn't say here, I already did count it. And it has, thanks God, it has a platinum trophy, which is great news for those uh, trophy hunters. Uh, has lots of gold trophies here, like says, like collect all mini kits, collect all bread bricks, complete all multi-part challenges. Has a, a lot of silver as well, like for example, rescue all civilians and master builders, defeat 20 enemies using Batman special moves, I guess you can use Batman too, defeat 100 enemies using special moves, defeat one of each enemy type, uh, let's go all the way down here, it says complete a skydive as Superman, have Batman, Superman and Wonder Woman, and Green Lantern in the same party. Not bad. Finish Submarine, finish Cloud Under Attack. Like you see, there's a lot of trophies. Some of them are gonna be easy, others won't be easy. Some of these, like these for example, you're gonna have to grind a lot, maybe. Let's go ahead back to the game. Okay, let's go ahead and get started here with the game. Let's go ahead and press play there. Uh, like you see here, this game actually is not like the consoles, which totally sucks. I don't get it why why they keep on doing this. They're giving, uh, giving this treatment to the PlayStation Vita, which totally sucks. Uh, the console version is way, way better. It's more open world. Let's go ahead here to the prologue. Uh, let's go ahead and click here, and let's go ahead and click play. Uh, like you can see, if you played the the Marvel Lego Marvel for the PlayStation Vita, this is basically same as that game, same as the Marvel game for the PlayStation Vita. Um, every you you go through the missions like per chapter, and every chapter has its challenges. Cover the what? 
Uh, spoiler, guys, if you haven't seen this movie, this game is actually going to spoil the whole movie for you. So, I recommend watching the movie first. The movie's freaking awesome. I did watch it yesterday, so I decided to get the game here. Okay. Okay. So like you see, every time you mis finish a uh, mission, you, you see everything that you unlocked. And you could either replay it again, or what's this? Oh, you could hear from here, you could deactivate touch or not. Okay. But yeah, like I said, this game is totally different to the one in the console. Um, I was gonna buy the console one, honestly. Uh, like I said before, I could play the PlayStation 4 version on my PlayStation V. So for me, let me see if I can touch this. Can I touch that? No, I can't. I can't get that. Maybe, at least not now. Uh, here you can either use the buttons. Or you could swipe on the screen, which I prefer to use a button. You know what? I might as well I might as well deactivate the touchscreen feature because I don't think I'm gonna be using it. I'd rather use the buttons than the screen. <laughs> oh, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to fix it. Okay, fix it. Da, 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 da. Okay. Is that how you use a wrench? <laughs> By slamming on the machine. <laughs> I gotta say, the colors of the game, the LEGO City, looks very, very beautiful. And I think if you like LEGO games, you're still gonna love this game. Uh, very beautiful game. It looks nice, even though it's not the same as the console, which totally sucks. Uh, this game still looks good. See if I can deactivate the freaking. Um, nope. I press here. No suck. I can't do nothing here. pages he finds to build special Lego objects. Okay. <laughs> Look at this guy. I guess I have to use uh, some pages here. Nice. Okay, so here, what am I supposed to do? This goes here. Yeah. Cool. Um, which one goes there? I don't think I have one that goes there. This one doesn't fit. Okay, it does, but it has looks different. There you go. Whoa! <laughs> Damn, where the hell did that come from? Level complete. Okay.
There we go. Oh crap. And done. Level complete. Not bad. So guys, like you saw right there, very cool gameplay this game has. I, I played a couple um, missions already and they are very, very good. The colors in in-game of Legos and the world are freaking awesome. Looks very nice. Uh, of course, like I said before, this is not like the play, like, like, like the console version. Yeah, totally sucks, but uh, it's still a gr uh, it's still playable, fun game, just like uh, Lego Marvel was to me. I did really like Lego Marvel game. So, um, guys, this is all I'm going to show right now. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know if you guys want to see anything more, any other gameplay from this game. So, till next time, guys.